Hello everyone, as promised, here we are at Geometry Dash. I have some good news and some bad news. Some good news is, I actually played a couple levels just now trying to collect the blue orbs, but the recording didn't go through. I had a technical error. Um, so yeah, so now I guess I have to redo this, but I'll be just playing the levels that I haven't achieved the orbs for, so you guys will see me do that. Alright, um, what can I say from what I know so far is that I'm pretty rusty. I don't know, I'm not as good, could be the fact that I'm playing this on the controller because I am used to the finger to screen touch mechanic better than the click of a button mechanic and this frankly takes a, I don't know if it's lagging or if it's psychological but like I feel like it, it's longer it takes longer to get something out of here either way uh, here we go so I'm gonna start with theory theory of everything in fact this is actually one of my favorite levels yes um, just so you know before today I haven't really played any of these since the last update so and I haven't really gone to the editor either so we'll, we'll see what that's about but let's start here because I'm just trying to refresh it up if you know what I mean okay here's something I don't understand right I can run games on their maximum graphical settings with 60 FPS running on a 4k monitor with 4k resolution and I usually have no problem I start playing Geometry Dash and then lag comes out of nowhere like there's no tomorrow. Is there something that I'm doing wrong or is this game just not very well optimized? Because there's a lot of lag that shouldn't be there. Well, it's not lagging as much now but it was earlier and I didn't know why. Yes, well this is one of my favorite levels. In fact it is why I chose this song for my following video. Falling level, sorry. Uh, that said, the level Falling and this song actually have no synchronization between them because the true synchronization to Falling would be the song Falling by Zap Flap, which I did not have when, the, when I made that level. So, damn, 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 damn. Okay. Uh, what is your favorite level? You guys let me know in the comments, I'd like to know which levels are your favorite levels from this game. Like official levels, not community levels. I am curious to know. Like I said, mine are uh, electrodynamics, theory of everything, one, not two. I can't beat two for the life of me, that's, I can't do demons. I can't. Yes, believe it or not, I cannot do demons. The only demons I've been are my own. Haha, <laughs> that could be metaphorical too. And, uh... Just this other one that I've seen in the past. It's one of those easy ones. Probably the most rated one. I don't know if it still is, but it was at the time. Um, yeah, I've never been any of the uh, demon levels by Rob Top. There was what was there? There was Club Step. There was Theory of Everything Two, and there was another one, Deadlocked or something. Yeah. Can't beat them. Won't even try. I when I did try, I'll be honest. When I first started playing them, I tried to play them practice mode and play, you know, try to get there. But to my surprise, once I saw the actual full video length of the level on YouTube, that's when I just said no, not happening. Now you could argue it's me rage quitting, but the truth is, it was. There comes a time when you gotta just tell you set your limits. You know, I now I know I know. If you, you know, as an optimist would say, you, you gotta go above the limit, you, you know, well, it's true. But there's also that mental state of mind that you gotta make sure you take care of because you don't wanna be, have anger management one day, right? You need to know how to keep yourself together. And those kind of levels really frustrate me because there's more crashing than there is playing, and there's more spamming of the button than there is actually timing things right, and I'm, I'm not a big fan of the whole spamming uh, gimmick. I, I am probably a hypocrite, because I probably do have that in some of my levels, like Matrix, that UFO scene, you know, I know how much a lot of you hate it, trust me, I did too, but that's 
lot of people think I did that because of, uh, you know, whatever, it's just the design of it. To be honest, when I made Matrix, I ran out of blocks, and that was the best I could come up with. That's when in the end it gets super slow and then kind of dry, there's not much else. Because there was not much else to do at the time. Uh, of course, there is more to, there's more space to build other things now, there's more, uh, I could place more objects, but I won't, I just don't want to go back and uh, deal with that again. Use the audio if it's bad in any way. I'm still experimenting with my setup. I don't really know. So let me know if you can hear me well, or if you can hear the game well, or if there's a way I can improve something. Just let me know. I'm always open for feedback and suggestions and any requests and advices. So feel free. Um, I've always loved this song, and I've always loved this level. Even though I can't beat it right now, it's still a good place in my heart for this level. Oh, this is one of those levels that I would replay when I was bored. No! I mean, yes, I would, but uh, <laughs> now I can't even beat it just for the sake of beating it. I truly think that playing this on a phone is much easier. The button aspect is too hard. Now I know, I know a lot of you play on mouse, and that's cool. I don't like that. I don't know. I just, cause I, I prefer to tap with my thumb, not with my uh, index finger. And I don't know. I feel like they're not the same. Now maybe my index finger is better. You're right. Maybe. Cause like when it comes to FPS games, you know, first person shooters. The FP, the uh, the mouse comes in handy, but I don't know if that's the same case for Jumpy Dash. It tends to be a little bit finicky. See, it's lagging. Why is it lagging? Stop lagging, my friend. Thank you. That was a little cool part. Something that I found interesting about the Electrodynamics song is it actually sounds like uh, extraterrestrials, aliens, uh, making a tra like a DJ track, a song. I'll have to play it for you guys so you understand what I mean, but it's, it's pretty interesting. I gotta say, I do miss this game. I do. And I miss these levels. I miss... I think one of the things I miss the most, specific to John Jadash, is when I've started playing for the very first time. Because remember, I came fresh out of uh, the Impossible game, and I discovered Geometry Dash. I'm like, what the hell is this? I'm like, oh, it's a ripoff of the Impossible game. Let's check it out. And to my surprise, the ripoff was good. <laughs> of course now, oh come on. Of course now, if anybody tries to play this game and then go back to playing the Impossible game, a lot of people say, oh, Impossible game sucks. It's so boring. There's only five levels. There's nothing to do. Oh, Jump to Dash is so much better. Here's the thing. The Impossible game came first. Okay? It's a classic. It came first. I don't care what you're going to argue. It is the forefather. It is the Adam of such games. Because let's be honest, Jump to Dash was not the first platformer like this. A lot of them came afterwards. Because they all mimicked the Impossible game. Well, as far as I'm concerned. I do miss playing the impossible game. Maybe I'll play those too. I gotta install that game. Play those five levels. They're just five levels, but they're so meaningful. A 
Although, same thing. I don't know if I like playing it on the controller or the mouse. Cause the controller feels better to hand, you know, to hold in your hand, but I don't know. The clicking may be faster from the mouse. I tapped. I did. Just didn't register fast enough. I'm sure we all say that to, that, to ourselves, don't we? I've tapped this. It's a stupid game. Does not know? If there's a lag, there's a real. Okay. Next level. Electroman Adventures. 200, 220. Okay. 295. Let's go. Bum, bum, bum. first starts, you don't think you like it, but then you realize you do. Because now it's becoming a vibe. Ah! See, when you don't remember what comes up, you don't know how to prepare your uh, finger to like, Do I hold it? Do I let go? Do I tap? I could have squeezed through there. Flappy Bird! Remember those days? The Flappy Bird days? The game came out of nowhere, guy got famous, decides to uninstall it because he did not want to be famous. Interesting, eh? Ah! Too fast! Too fast for my liking! So, this is the song I was talking about. I want you all to close your eyes and listen to this song for a bit, okay? Tell me it doesn't sound like an alien or an extraterrestrial making like a, a mix, a track. <laughs> it just, it sounds so foreign. I just picture this party, like in in some sort of you know spacious universe. Like just picture there's this party, and you got these aliens on the DJ booth, and they're just mixing this. They're just <laughs> jamming. Yes, even Sheriff cannot defeat his favorite levels, whether it's Theory of Everything or Electrodynamics. I just can't! I'm so bad. 
god, I'm so rusty. Or maybe it is the controller. Maybe it is the controller. Hold on. I'm gonna try the mouse. Ah, this feels weird with my index finger. But it's so much faster, it's so much more responsive. See, I clicked. Now you don't think I did. You think I'm just bad, but I, I clicked. I'm clicking! What is going on? Oh, maybe, maybe the mouse has to be in the screen. Okay, see, now it's lagging. Don't tell me it's not lagging, because it is. Still lagging. Still lagging. Stop of the lag. There we go. Wait, nope. Still lagging. Okay, there we go. Okay. I don't want to stay here too long. Hexagon Forest. Sure. Let's see what you got. Hate the upside down. Hate it so much. I like to sing when the music's good for me. Okay, nope. This is like a robot jamming now. That was the alien jamming before, now it's robots. You ever play this game and a person's next to you listen to the music and you kept crashing and they're like, yo, I'm trying to listen to the track. And you're like, yeah, sorry, I suck. <laughs> the end I know it was okay let's try to get this one see every time I play this I get some sonic vibes it's a mix of sonic and mario vibes Stick to the mouse. I keep contemplating this decision. I can't. I don't know. Like, I enjoy playing with the controller. But the mouse is so much faster. Ooh, that's going fast. Chill. I can't register in my head. Calm down. Damn, 
see how am I supposed to know it's gonna be an abrupt wall just going down by the time you see it it was too late depending on the you know okay I'm just gonna shut up I'm gonna shut up and try again Another question though, I'm gonna ask you guys. Which mode is your favorite mode? Like, is it, the, is it the gravity ball? Is it the square? Is it the flappy bird? Is it the. You know. Uh, my. I think mine would be the cube, it'll be the square. After that. Might be the, the UFO, and then from the UFO might be the gravity. And then I like the spider. Actually, I'm a fan of the spider. Maybe I'll pick this last. See, the ones I'm not a big fan of are the jets and um, what else is there? The wave, uh, see the wave it depends, sometimes it's fun, sometimes it's not. My worst nightmare though is when you do the upside down thing and then you got a uh, jet. Oh man, that frustrates me, I hate the upside down with the jet. It's just, your mind doesn't register exactly what to do and by the time you get it, there's all the lag. Or at least hey, that's my mind. If your mind can do it, then good for you. you know, you've been eating a lot of fish, you've been keeping that brain healthy of yours. I'm, uh... Ooh, it's getting colorful. Yeah, I didn't remember! I don't remember what happens there! I haven't been any of the uh, demon levels. None. I'm just not a very demonic person. What could I say? I don't like them. I like the classic levels. You know, the, oh, Can't Let Go is a very fun level. Can't Let Go is a very good level. Uh, I do like Finger Dash. I already have the blue orbs for this, but I am willing to play it again. It's fun. See, this is a good level. Music synchronization here, the, the feeling of it, the gameplay's fun, it looks fun, the music is nice. Again, the synchronization is very on point. Look at that, that was just impressive, you know? These are the kind of levels you need. And another thing that's important to uh, mention about levels is the simplicity factor. Like, there's a lot going on here, right? But you could still see, it's not blinding. Not, it's not taking your attention away from where you gotta go or what you gotta do. Because a lot of levels I noticed today from the community, is a lot of them are um, uh, distracting. You don't know where to go or do because everything's just all over the place. And you're like, whoa, look, you're just too overwhelmed. Man. I'm trying to play here, not, <laughs> not try to spy a, a moving object. Anyways, I think I'm gonna stop it there for now because I don't want I don't want this video to get too long. Um, I will in the next episode of Jump to Dash I will play my own levels, and after that I think I'm gonna start playing and taking requests. I would like to see what a lot of you guys are doing, whether it's levels that you've made yourselves or levels that you want me to see or react to or play or whatever just send me down your request let me know what you guys have and i'll try to play those again my tolerance is uh i will try to beat out i won't try to rage quit so easily however i don't want to spend too much time in one video doing one level because i feel like i want to experiment more uh that said i think uh, 
20 25 minute video alone is pretty long so i think i'm gonna stop it there next few videos we will play uh, my levels and uh that said as you can see i'm still rusty i can't even be rob tops levels for now so that's something i'll have to get better at but nevertheless thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next video peace Thank you.